nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition. And lift off. Got One Bravo call is for the second stage abort mode on the first stage that is going to take them through the first stage burning just before the second stage activates off the coast of North Carolina. That next milestone coming up shortly will be MVAC chill underway. MVAC chill underway. There's a call out. We're getting the second stage engine turbo pumps ready for their ignition coming up in just a little more than uh, 40 seconds. We've got the major events coming up here shortly. We're going to get main engine cutoff at two minutes, 36 seconds. The stages will separate. And then the second stage will ignite carrying Dragon on its way into low Earth orbit. Everything continues to look good. Stage one throttle down. Stage one throttling down at three and a half G's. Getting ready for Miko. Miko. Stage separation. Stage two alpha. Copy, two alpha. All right, we have a ignition of the second stage and you saw that green flash Dude, of that t-tab fluid and crew three is now on their way to the international space station on the left side first stage you can see the titanium grid fins coming out the streaks uh, of the exhaust of the second stage engine going by and the lights of Florida down in the background. Position signal. That's right, and on your right, that second stage glowing. With that red color we like to see, indicating everything is proceeding well. Now three minutes and 40 seconds into flight, everything's still on track. Acquisition of signal, Bermuda. Dragon SpaceX, trajectory and that nominal. Call, that call out of acquisition of signal, copies. Bermuda, that just means the Bermuda ground station has the signals from the second stage of Dragon and Falcon 9. Now currently on the first stage, we are coasting to Apogee, beginning a slow 180 degree pitch so that when the vehicle comes back through the atmosphere, the engines are pointed down towards the drone ship when we do the relight. Relight for the entry burn will come at T plus seven minutes and 30 seconds, three minutes from now. Currently the first stage about 166 kilometers up, continuing to coast to Apogee for another brief period. 
Meanwhile, that second stage still propelling the Crew-3 astronauts up the eastern seaboard, and it will continue to fire. That's about a six-minute burn to deliver the astronauts into orbit. Dragon SpaceX trajectory nominal. Endurance copies. And a good call out from the ground teams. I always love to hear trajectory nominal, and the crew gets to hear it too on the call out. Acquisition signal, New Hampshire. And the New Hampshire tracking station has acquired the telemetry signal. Five minutes and 30 seconds into flight today, everything is still proceeding nominal. And Courtney, right now on the second stage, uh, it's such a uh, large amount of propellant. It takes a while for second stage to uh, really accelerate. The crew right now Dragon looks like they're pulling about. Nominal. Looks like we're pulling about Remember one and a half G's. Yeah, right on cue, those check-ins on the second stage performance. Everything is still looking good on that second stage. The next milestone on the second stage will be SECO. And we're getting our views now from inside of Endurance, our first views of the crew on their way to the International Space Station. We're one minute away from entry burn of the first stage. Hopefully we'll get a camera view back on the first stage as we uh, light the three engines to come back into the Earth's atmosphere. Dragon SpaceX, trajectory nominal. Endurance copies. Another good check-in with the crew, confirming everything is still looking good so far on both ends. That next milestone coming at 7 minutes and 30 seconds will be entry burn start. Currently waiting for the call-out from the SpaceX propulsion responsible engineer that the three Merlin 1D engines have lit to begin the slow, to begin slowing down the first stage. Prior to entering the Earth's Stage atmosphere. two FTS is safe. Stage one entry burn is in startup. We've heard stage one entry burn is startup. We've lit the center engine. We've got the two side engines, three engines running. This is a 27 second burn. This will slow the first stage down. We'll then enter the atmosphere where the grid fins begin to work. And then we will fire the single center engine as we approach the drone ship. Stage one, entry burn shut down. Confirmation, entry burn shut down. And meanwhile, that second stage is less than a minute away from cutoff. Stage two in terminal guidance. Shannon. Copy Shannon. There's that call for Shannon. Stage one is transonic. Stage one decelerating as we prepare for entry burn. But our attention is right now looking at stage two as we get Head ready for shutdown. shutdown. Stage one landing burn. Dragon SpaceX, nominal orbit insertion. And the second stage has done its job. Our crew three astronauts have been delivered into orbit. Stage one, landing leg deploy. Landing uh -huh. leg deploy. And there's copies. We feel Pico and uh, file confirms we are in space. Dragon SpaceX, launch escape system is disarmed. Thank you. 
Stage one landing is confirmed. And we've heard the call out. Stage one landing is confirmed. Signal Cape and acquisition of signal Newfoundland. Some great call outs. That next milestone is spacecraft separation around 12 minutes into flight. Getting a view now of the Crew-3 astronauts from a camera aboard Dragon. The crew now coasting in low Earth orbit, still attached to that second stage. Again, that next milestone coming in about two minutes. That second stage will separate and Crew Dragon will be flying free. And Courtney, right now, the Falcon 9 second stage is still attached to the Dragon capsule. When it's time, Dragon will command separation from the Falcon 9 second stage. Right now, that second stage under control of its flight computer is essentially going through a sequence to idle the second stage, make sure we're not pulsing any of the cold gas thrusters, the engine has been purged out, essentially anything that might cause motion of the second stage, we're making sure that all of that is eliminated so that when Dragon separates, it's got a very stable platform to move away from. Cheering in the background, uh, they're getting video back of Falcon 9 first stage on drone ship as we get ready for Dragon separation. That's right, John. Separation coming just 10 seconds from now. Standing by for that call. Expected the loss of the signal, wallops. And again, we are standing by. There we go. Dragon separation confirmed. Dragon, copy to the Dragon, CE, welcome to orbit. Hope you enjoyed the ride from F9. Dragon will take you from here. Safe travels. Stand by for words from LD. And Endurance, LD here. On behalf of the SpaceX launch and recovery teams, it was a pleasure to be part of this mission with you. Enjoy your holidays amongst the stars. We'll be waving as you fly by. Cheers. Wow. Incredible views of the crew now in orbit on their way Thanks, to the uh, International guys, Space Station. It was a great ride, better than we imagined. And some final words from the crew as well. There they are, our Crew-3 astronauts. Now in orbit, that next milestone will be the deployment of the nose cone. That'll be about a five minute process. It'll expose those forward bulkhead Dracos and we'll prepare them for checkouts as well. Yeah, Courtney, watching them in zero-G right now, working their displays, it looks so easy, but we had the benefit of watching the, the launch team, the spacecraft team, the NASA team, everybody working here for the last weeks, working through this, and it's good to see it come out looking just so easy right now. Yep, it's been a long time coming, and we're so excited to see them in orbit. Dragon SpaceX, nominal, nominal dehumidifier activation and service section Draco checkouts.